do available singles in your area laugh when they see the ridiculously inadequate length of your tool? Do you need a truncheon in your chuck? Do you struggle to reach full depth? Well, fear not, we may have the solution. Obviously, what we're talking about here is drill bits. Um, this is too short, I need to drill a very deep hole. Um, and I'm too cheap to, to shell out on a, a long, a long uh, drill bit. Uh, I don't, in fact, think that even a long series drill bit is going to be long enough. So what I need to do is extend my shaft. So the first thing we're going to do, we're going to have a look. Uh, this is a brand new drill bit. It's 12 millimeter. Um, we're going to look at the uh, at the shank here and see whether it's uh, whether it's soft enough to machine. So a little bit of a hit with the file. Oh, lovely! What you'll find with most HSS drill bits is that although the tip itself is very hard. The shank is um, soft enough to be machined. Uh, so what we're going to do, um, we're going to turn this down slightly and then we're going to take this piece of 12 millimeter um, mild steel and we're going to make a, make a hole that's about the right size and we're going to shrink fit this into it. Um, if shrink fitting doesn't work there's two backup options. One is to uh, to hit it with some some Loctites, and worst case, although I don't actually have any oxygen at the moment, is to braze it. So let's see what we can do. Um, so first thing to do, let's get this chucked up in a collet, and I want to take that down. It's 12, 12 millimeters. I want to take that down to yeah, probably seven, I would have thought. So I've got enough enough weight around it. Um, I might take it down to nine and see where we go from there. Uh, I think it's nine only leaves me a mil and a half on the other side, which is not very much. So we can keep Chinese carbide in on the in on the job. Now this is something that I normally don't film. Machining action. Let's see whether we can get in there and get some action on that. Because I had people moaning that they couldn't see any chips. So put that in there. Bit of manual focus. Let's see what happens. This could be exciting. See how hard it is. Oh no, it's okay. So, cheap Chinese carbide will do it. Um, this is a Tivoli drill. Yeah, this is a Tivoli drill. Cheap Chinese carbide will do the job. We're going in by 19 millimeters. That means that I can go in to 20 mil deep on the uh, on the tube. And we should have enough to go in. That was a that was a 0.1 millimeter cut. So one and a half. Let's take from half a millimeter off. A bit more. Yeah, what I'm going to do, choke it up a bit more.
Well, stage one seems to have gone remarkably well. There we go. That's at uh, seven and a half millimetres, or seven point six, seven five five, seven point six. So what we're going to do now? Make the end of this nice and square. Drill, and then we're going to make a nice big hole in it. Cleaned up. I haven't, haven't cleaned up.
сейчас смотрю. Где суд делает? See what's going on here? Yes. Right, micrometer time. So, seven point five two, according to that. Seven point five two. So I've got to take off exactly half a millimetre. Okay, that's a uh, hole which is a couple of hundredths um, oversize, which is a bit of a shit. I was aiming for undersize. There you go, never mind. I'm going to give it some, some of that. Good break cleaner. Get in there. Um, get some of that there as well. And what we're going to do is hit it with some uh, with some press block, block press. Block tight. 
uh, the equivalent of Loctite 638. I would have put on there if I had any, but I don't. So I have Loctite 8331. Just the same stuff, basically. If I can get the lid off. Don't use this very often. In fact, I use it so frequently that it appears to have stopped the fucking lid on. Oh dear. Well, to clean, it does. Still. Anyway, look, we'll let that set, and we'll give it a try later. That definitely wants a clean. So here's the final setup. Um, I've taken out my normal tailstock ram. Um, I've fitted my lever action W20 collet tailstock ram, which uh, which allows me to. go much much deeper or shorter depending on where I want to be so I can come out to an enormous depth like so it doesn't have the most enormous throw Although actually if I adjusted it, it could probably have more. How about that? There you go, we can get to there. So we've got about an 80 mil throw on that. Um, this enables me to do, or should enable me to do, some fairly deep hole drilling. So um, there we go. Um, I don't have the stock to make uh, what I should be making here, which is a gun drill. Um, and I'm not sure that any of this is hard enough to be able to chop it off and, and gun drill it. Um, so we're going to give this a go. We'll probably go in from both ends. And um, it's only a first hole anyway. And then I can go in with a long boring bar and clear stuff up. But there we go, that's where we're at. This is of course for drilling the hole down the centre of the uh, of the new spindle for the mill. So, extend your cock. See ya.